Hey there Internet, this is Chris Chiswaldi here for GameZone.com bringing you the first exciting installment of what I like to call The Outsiders. This is where a logo just showed up on my hand if I learned how to use my video editing software correctly. Point is that there's a lot of games out there right now that don't really get the attention they deserve. Maybe overshadowed by your A-list titles like Halo or Final Fantasy. You get it. You kids, you want to play the big blockbuster hits, but you're missing out on a lot of fun stuff. There's a lot of games coming out that maybe are a little under the radar, but definitely deserve their fair shake. Today we're looking at the WiiWare title Bit Trip Runner from Gaijin Games. It's a game that's not that easy to classify. I guess you would call it a rhythm game, but it's also part platformer. It's kind of like Guitar Hero with a jump button. If that makes any sense, well, you're crazy, because that doesn't make any sense. If you're wondering what the plot of Bit Trip Runner is, I really couldn't tell you. All I know is that you control the actions of a little pixel man apparently sent from the Intellivision era. His only notable ambition in life is to just keep running, and running, and running. It kind of reminded me of the movie Crank, you know? The one where Jason Statham has to keep running around punching people in the face or else his heart's gonna explode. Only here the Chinese gangsters have all been replaced with space rocks and fireballs and stuff. The point of the game is simple, to get from one end of the stage to the other, avoiding any obstacles that might stand in the way of your impressive marathon. You've got four different buttons here, a jump button for getting over stuff, a slide for getting under stuff, a kick for breaking through stuff, and a button to activate springboards. It's clean and simple game design, though. Don't mistake simple for easy. No, this game is devastatingly hard. It starts you off slow, sure, lets you get a feel for the controls, but the next thing you know, obstacles are coming at you so fast your brain is scrambling to keep up. The graphics are a real trick. You think you're in for nothing more challenging than Pitfall, but that misplaced confidence wears off mighty quick. But what really makes Bit Trip Runner such an engaging experience is just how masterfully the music ties into the gameplay. Each level starts off with the same sort of simple bass rhythm which continues to evolve as you successfully navigate each stage. And each action rewards you with a satisfying boop or beep, which in succession works to provide the score of the level. For instance, jumping up a series of steps might make the noise of a rising musical scale, or a series of well-timed jumps provides a simple back and forth rhythm that underscores your success at the twitchy gameplay. It really is beautifully addicting, though. Maybe a little too much. Hey, Chris! Hey! Chris! Uh, Chris, what? Uh, what are you doing, man? Uh, uh, Why are you laying in the street holding a Wiimote? Nah, I'm just... I'm just hanging out. Chris, have you been bit tripping again? No, <laughs> man, I don't... I don't do that anymore, man. Uh. But listen, listen, is, is there like a rainbow chasing me? What the f are you talking about, man? There's no f***ing rainbow! It just keeps pulling me back in. I just need like... I mean, I'm on like the last couple stages and they're... Oh, Jesus Christ, you're in the really street! Hard. Get up! Almost, get up! I just... <laughs> get up off the ground! Look at you! It's too much! It's too much for one man to handle! Why did they make it so hard? So if you're tired of blowing your WiiWare points on ports of games you bought 10 years ago, maybe it's time to give something like Bit Trip Runner a try. I promise you won't be disappointed. Now, if you'll excuse me, there's... A lot of suburban mothers are kind of weirded out that I'm in this playground with their children. It's understandable. This mustache kind of makes me look like a level 2 sex offender. I think they're calling the cops. 